I think we've been brought up in a world that we have to have five bedrooms or we have to have a dining room, we have to have... And I think if you could use the space more efficiently, you would need a smaller footprint. I'm Karen Lloyd-Jones and I've been involved with CAT for five years. Um, I do, I work on the courses. Um, it's quite important to, to show youngsters what's possible by doing simple things um, and to inspire them as well to maybe look at uh, using sustainable materials or sustainable building methods as a, a positive career path. Um, you can visit, it for, visit us for a day or you can come to do the postgraduate course for 18 months. So it, that depends on what you want to learn and how you want to take it on. The Tiny House course is a new, a new course for this year. So I come up with the, the idea of building a garden room, tiny house structure that people could use in their own way as being a, an office or a, a garden room. And because Kevin McLeod had just built his garden room uh, during a, a mini-series, I thought it'd be a good idea to replicate that in a mini version of it. He built a, a tiny house, but I built a tinier house. So my property secret would, would be to have more multifunctioning spaces in your house. Um, and obviously you would need a smaller footprint which means a cost saving, especially with land prices these days. Uh, down, people call it downsizing, but it's actually downsizing the size of the property, but you still got the same amount of usage from the property. 